impose their will on the interior, scoring a lot of points in the painted area. And on top of that, they're getting a lot of points off assists. And it's always a good sign when your team is working as a cohesive unit. Boston Trail. Tatum down low. Tatum on him. It's tipped. And here we go. The East with a fast break. Took the opportunity when he saw it. Well, that steal was really triggered by the quick instincts of DeRozan. Very aware and then anticipating the pass. Smart dishes to Horford. Over DeRozan. That's good from Horford on the assist from Smart. Nice play call there. Down the stretch, getting him the open look. Yeah, I put that one on the defense. I mean, they can't leave him open at this stage. And this is Gilgis Alexander's responsibility to find his guys when they're open. Now a timeout called by Boston. And at this point of the game, getting a break here, important for the teams to regroup and for the players. This is where you have a chance to get rehydrated with Gatorade. Get ready to play strong to finish off the game. Here's what the East is going with right now. Donovan Mitchell's checked in for Holiday. And it's John Morant in for Gilgis Alexander. And with an update from the sideline, let's check in with David Aldridge. Hey, Kevin. Well, the head coach for Boston had some instructions for the guys during the timeout. He knows they struggled at the free throw line, but he actually looked at the positive. He said, if we continue to get to the foul line, good things are going to happen. But we have to keep getting there. Maybe that'll take the heat off him a little. Thank you, David. Now, here's DeRozan. Jason Tatum missing his last shot. I didn't see that miss coming. I mean, he's usually been money from that range. Horford finds Brown. The shot's Jaylen good Brown. on the assist by Horford. Assist. Seven now points Horford. for Jalen Brown. I think that's where Brown is at his best, guys. He's a muscular athlete who loves finishing strong through contact. Giannis passes to DeRozan. Here's Antetokounmpo. Down through the hoop it goes. That's his fifth make on nine shots from the floor. His hard work on the backboard really just has given them more opportunities to score. And the rejection by Tatum. And how about the craftiness from Tatum? He plays smart, quick hands on defense, and able to block the shot. And over two and a half minutes in the books here in the fourth. Count that one in the East All-Stars. Lead has been cut down to four on the bucket from Smart. And here's Moran. He'll bring it up for the East All-Stars. And DeRozan kicks to Tatum. Moran with it. Picked up by Brown. Near the three-point line. It's Mitchell. Offensive rebound. Rosen dishes to Mitchell for three. Rebound by Williams. Williams has got double-digit rebounds now in the game. Tatum down low. Guarded by Tatum. And the shot goes down. And now just a two-point East All-Star lead. A bit under three and a half minutes have passed here in the fourth. The three from Morant. Offensive rebound and finish off by DeRozan. Turning up the temperature on his intensity that time. DeRozan getting it done in the big time moments. Horford no up. Oh, you, you've got to be able to deliver when you get a bunny like that. That's just too easy of a shot to miss. East ball. Great instincts from him to get a hand on that pass and tip it out. And, you know, even though they didn't come up with the steal, that's still a nice defensive play. Siakam is checked in for the East. At the elbow, it's Antetokounmpo. Two for Williams. Two and Boston with the rebound. Brown's got his fifth rebound right now in the game. Williams with the ball. Now guarded by Tatum. Well, he is a behemoth in the paint. Once Williams establishes himself, he almost half the foul. Right on the first, and that narrows the lead down to just three. And he cannot convert on the second. That misses. If he hits all of those, they're feeling a lot more comfortable. But now, still a one-possession game. Timeout. A true leader. You can tell Morant takes pride and stepping up when it matters most. Now a timeout called by Boston. They're trailing by five. 146 left in the fourth quarter. And now let's present our New Balance Player of the Game, DeMar DeRozan. A no-brainer choice here, I mean, given how incredible he's played. 
just decimated the defense and did whatever he wanted to. No doubt in anybody's mind that this award was going to him. And Tatum has been in these situations before. He's reliable when it comes to stepping up in big moments. Defensive massive move there from Siakam. We've seen him do it in the finals. This guy showing he's made for big moments. Brown and finished off by Brown. Hey, and with Brown, guys, it doesn't matter what point in the game it is. I mean, he's ready to shoot whenever he has the ball in a good spot. Here's Tatum. And it's sent back by Horford. And they'll keep possession. Back to Giannis. That one, no good. And it's Boston the other way. Smart misses. Well, that's a look he has to finish, and he knows it. Blowing opportunity. Giannis, that's a two-pointer. The putback, Morant on the phone. And going back to college, Morant made a habit of rising to the occasion. And Smart with the drive. It drops. What a beautiful shot to bring him to within three. And you want him taking big shots for you in big moments. That one was as easy as it gets. Well, you don't want to give him any open shots at this stage. Never mind the layup. Come on now. My goodness. Now here's Williams. Following the miss by John Morant. And here's Tatum for three. The kick out to Brown. The second chance effort in the corner. Tatum with it. Can't tie it up as that one misses. Guys, it's come down here to a very important possession. No room for error. Looking to tie it up with a big triple. You don't want to force it, though. Still need to get a quality look. Siakam passes to Tatum, and he commits the intentional foul. Had to foul and on that occasion to stop the clock. That's the enemy in this situation. And you know what? He knows if he misses at the strike. They're right there within range. You know, late game free throws are a lot different than early game free throws in terms of making them. It looks like he was a little tight on the line that time. Could have and should have closed it out. And you can't get a bigger bucket than that. Well, that was one, too. He wanted the ball. Nobody else was taking that shot. Timeout called. East all -Star. There's 10 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Boy, it's so much fun seeing Brown drop the hammer. It's an amazing dunker who fastens the basket. Timeout called East All Star. They're trailing by two. Five seconds left here in the fourth quarter. Is what's your take? I don't think they should be here and think about a triple. With this much time left, I'd attack the basket, get a high percentage shot in tight, and take my chances in overtime. Big time play there for Mitchell. Remember, he's been the go-to guy since his rookie year. Fans, the Lava section gets free t-shirts. Let's see who's the loudest. Get ready for your East Coast Sports Podcast. Come on, fans! Stand up and make some noise! And regulation now complete. We will go to overtime. Don't go anywhere, folks. We'll be back in just a moment. These teams have battled tooth and nail for four quarters, and now we head to overtime. Should be a blast. Here we go. And Boston has possession. Siakam is out there with Tatum. Then it's Donovan Mitchell. Then there's John Morant. Jason and it's Giannis in at the five. Tatum's got a lot of options he can go to on his finishes inside. This guy is a smooth operator close to the hoop. And to Dekumbo. And on to Dekumbo on the follow. You know, feeling very comfortable taking a big shot when his team needs it. That's a, that's a sign of how Ante Dekumbo has matured recently. Now here's Brown. Tatum down low. Tatum on him. Here's Brown. Williams trying to break free. And there's Brown. That's good on the assist by Tatum. And the Celtics lead by two. Here's Morant. 
Up again. Great positioning on the putback. You can tell that Giannis takes pride in his activity level, the way he plays, his intensity level. And you see the result of that activity on second chance buckets like this. Here's Tatum. And Tatum pulls it down. Tatum's got six rebounds here tonight. And the whistle blows. It's going to be on John Moran. That's his first foul. Gildas Alexander's checked in for John Moran. Into the lineup for your East All-Stars. Shane Gildas Alexander. It's extra time here. Just over a minute into overtime. The feed to Brown. Pulls it from the elbow. Good, and Smart gets the assist. Hey, Brown is very serious about his scoring. Man. He's got the green light to fire up from just about anywhere out there, and he takes full advantage of it. And the East All-Stars call time here. They're down by two. 141 left in the first overtime. Here's Gilgis Alexander. Plenty of room to knock down the shot. And that's 13 points for Shea Gilgis Alexander. He's so clutch. When the pressure is at its highest, that's when he's at his very best. Brown, the best is smart. He scores his fifth field goal. He's taken nine shots to get those five. Boy, Brown, not just a super athlete, folks, but he's got excellent skills as well. A tremendous floor general. And another great look at the 2K drop. Celtics foul. Tremendous effort. Putting pressure on the rim here at a critical time in this game. And the first of two, no good. Heartbreaker. Jay Gilgis Alexander at the line for two. He can't make a second free throw either. Listen both. And we've seen SGA blossom into a number one option. Another chance here to prove himself. And close to making the defense pay for the lax coverage that time. And good. Got the friendly bounce off the right side of the rim. Giannis has got it all tied up now for the East All-Stars. And it's smart with the ball for the Boston Celtics. Over to the wing. Here's Horford. A kick out to Brown. Tatum dishes to Brown. Back to Tatum. Six on the shot clock. And that one goes out of bounds. Last touch by Tatum. Four on the shot clock. Tatum's shot is off. This could be a turning point. Critical possession right here. Got it. And Tatum continues to evolve before our eyes, showing excellent leadership by knocking down these clutch shots. Mm. Smart passes to Williams. Rebound by the East All-Stars. That is some tough defense there against one of the better finishers in our game. And delivering in the clutch. Siakam with zero fear. Wanting the ball when it matters most. Can't waste any time here. No, you need a quick bucket and then a quick pop. You're smart. They get it back. Tries again. It counts. And he has brought them to within two points. And, and that's a great play on the backboard for him. I mean, it's what we expect. All his second chance points do not come by accident. Now a timeout called by the East. They're ahead by two. There's 18 seconds left in the first overtime. Action has been terrific. And so they foul intentionally. Smart. First personal foul. Second team foul. And he cannot get the first one to drop. Oh, Tough one to miss. Stars, Jay Gilgis Alexander. And he can't get the second one to drop either. Coming up empty that time. Right side smart. There's the triple. No good from three-point territory. And now an intentional foul. They need the ball back as soon as possible. Second personal foul. Third team He doesn't foul. hit the first, and that was the one they the one. really want. He's got one more, though. Jay Gilgis Alexander. Two shots. So neither attempt will fall that time for him. From 15 feet away. And the rejection by Giannis. Here's Tatum. So it's the East All-Stars taking the W in a close one. They escaped with a victory, although they needed an extra period. Big thank you to all.